The full episode is now available on Patreon and YouTube memberships. Please see the link in the description for more details. So, Trey, we saw, we, yes. we saw the trailer. Trey, mm. what did you think of the trailer? Because I, I, I'm sure, because I'm pretty sure Preston will agree with you based on what you told me. Uh, it's uh, not much. Not much is shown. Um, let's see. Let's see if there's anything of note. Because I watched both of them. Both of them use a lot of clips from each other. Mm. Mm-hmm. Um, That's true. So so like there's very there's very few unique clips to each one. Um like the the green trailer kind of like I don't know they don't show you much of all. They show you a lot of scenes of the interior of uh the the red keep. Um you see spitfires, right? You see like or, or ballistas. You see Oh, the scorpions. Um the scorpions, yeah, sorry, the scorpions. Um which and then we see what else? I, I'm looking at the green trailer right now scrolling through is just a lot of just a lot of scenes of like small council people riding horses <laughs> um yeah. let's see let's see okay you see some some new dragons we haven't seen before right we, so sunfire we briefly it. saw sunfire episode seven uh lena's funeral for house of dragon season one and now we get a slightly better look at sunfire very sleek dragon okay okay what oh i see like a lady a lady wearing like a bracken um uh like outfit I think that's a lady. Maybe yeah, it's a, a guy with long hair. I don't know who that is. Um, I mean, it's probably a, a bracket, the, the House of Burning Mill kind of kind of situation. Um, so what what did surprise me about the trailer is how little how little in it actually seems to match with events that we know are going to be occurring. You know, so like yeah, and and. There's a there's one big reason for that, and that is Rhaenyra in Fire and Blood. Rhaenyra has very little to do with the events um, of this period, and yet she's the star of the mm. fucking show. So you can't not have Rhaenyra there, right? So it seems like there's a lot of kind of invented time to give to give Rhaenyra some screen time, but <clears throat> yeah, the event the events that are going on here is you should have, um. You know the uh, the the events of Stony Sept and Burning Mill, which is which is essentially the the Brackens and the Blackwoods and and uh, Damon taking the Riverlands. And I you know you I do mm. see there's a scene of Damon on the on the the parapet of a, of a castle, and so I'm assuming it's him taking taking Heron Hall and, Heron and, Hall and conquering the Riverlands, yeah. and then. You know, after that, we we know we're gonna get up. You know, have events leading up to Rook's Rest, where the Greens go into into Cracklaw Point. Um, and we also know that there's going to be the the Cargyle twin fight, which and I do see Cargyle, one of the Cargyles, like fighting. So I'm assuming that it's going to be the Cargyle on Cargyle thing. But other than that, you know. For instance, there's a bunch of like yeah. raining and dragons in the rain, and you're like, where does that come yeah. from? I don't. Is that him taking Heron Hall? Is is that? Um, I don't know why there'd be all of this like dragons flying in the rain. Uh, it's cool as fuck to have like dragons in the night in the rain, and uh, it, once again, it reminds me of Jurassic Park where uh, the T-Rex shows up in the paddock. And yeah. uh, it, it was just a cool scene. And I, I, I they probably want to recreate that. They, they kind of did towards the end of last season. And obviously, with, obviously uh, CGI, CGI where there's darkness and atmosphere and things like that does look better than CGI that's, you know, bright in the middle Broad of daylight. the sunshine. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I guess we see a funeral. We see... Um, we see the f- wait. Which trailer are you looking at? The black. I'm in, trailer? I'm in the. I'm in the black trailer, and at around, um, at around 59 seconds, there is a there is a quick scene of Alice of Alicent and, um, Helena, dressed up for the funeral, probably, of their of their of the children the children after um, the blood, blood and cheese, cheese incident. Yeah. Uh, shortly there, okay. uh, at one minute, uh, is that Tim seven Poole? seconds. What? Tim Pool? Where? <laughs> Tim Pool. Go, go to go to one minute, and oh. you'll see Tim Pool with his beanie on, 
on the horse. What, what are you talking with Preston? What the fuck In are you talking Allison. about? At one minute? At the one minute, was your, your video Your video is one minute and 57 seconds at the one minute mark. Oh my fucking God. I see what you're talking it's, about. No, that's not Tim Pool. It's Tim Pool, it's Tim Pool like in him. his black beanie on a dragon in front of Allison. <laughs> that, that's interesting. Uh, that's an interesting direction there. I wonder if. <laughs> I was not, a, guy. I was not that expecting one. that. <laughs> <laughs> this fucking guy at one minute seven oh, seconds we have uh moon dancer moon dancer and moon dancer moon dancer let's see what uh, that's one of the pictures i sent you guys privately moon okay. uh moon dancer the green one so they're giving moon the answer is the one that was raised in the veil right what's the one that was raised in the veil uh that's m maybe morning morning okay okay you're right <laughs> Moon Dancer, uh, Moon Dancer, um, gets a only really plays a role right kind of near the end of the war. Um, so they're 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 clearly trying to give, um, uh, the 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 twins some some. Oh role to yeah, play. I remember now. Yeah, yeah. Honestly, because they're going to because they're only going to do eight episodes and because we're going to probably stretch it out um, to have more stuff for HBO to put out because their, their catalog's looking pretty dry. I don't blame them for trying to like put some stuff in here. Uh, I hope it's not like filler-esque, like Arya cleaning bodies or Sam and Gilly again. Um, I'm sure it's going to be way more interesting. It's a fucking woman riding a dragon. Like, that's cool as fuck. But what I would recommend that they do, and I would hope that they do, is more scenes like the Bracken versus Blackwood fight, where we get houses squaring off against each other. Uh, maybe some houses in other places who have been always allies and now have to take sides and kill each other. Something like that oh, would yeah. be kind of cool. Um, Butterwell, you know, just, Butterwell, just to fill time. I want some obscure, some obscure house that's like barely, barely. Butterworth, what is that one? Butterwell. <laughs> Butterwell. I think it's Butterwell. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, bring them in. Bring them in. These houses that we don't hear about too much. I would. I, yeah, see the I mean, obviously, I would love that. I guess we do get a quick scene of Jace at the wall. Um, so yeah, that's yeah. The, that's we, the pictures I sent both of you. Is uh, we get the we get the back of Cregan's head and Jace at the wall. Which Preston, correct me, or, correct, correct me, but he we don't get information that he ever goes to the wall in Fire and Blood, do we? No, no. Oh, but yeah, there yeah. there's a there's a rumor that perhaps uh, you know he he laid some eggs or something. I I want to say I'm trying to remember because because we don't really have a very good. I mean, every everything about what Jace did up there is is kind of is kind of off. But um, we get rumors that he was fooling around with Cregan's bastard, bastard sister daughter, Sarah Snow. Sarah Snow, um, is that sister or daughter? I thought it was. Uh, is it Cregan's daughter? Maybe I have to look this. I up. remember it being his sister. Let me check real quick. Uh, I mean, Cregan yeah, uh, Cregan is old, is young, so. Maybe daughter according to of Mushroom Rickon Stark. Yeah, so I'm I'm gonna go with sister. Uh, sister. All right. Uh, no, it's oh, okay. Yeah, so Rickon's Rickon Stark. Yeah, um, yeah, because because Rickon is the one that except though they, did they change his name in the show? Doesn't he say Rickard? In in remember the the person that that swears their allegiance. Um. That that dude's accent is so fucking thick. What like I, yeah. I'll take it. I'll take whatever. So I'll take whatever. Maybe Sandra. Sandra. It's his. It's his daughter, uh, Cregan. Cregan's half sister. Yeah. I'll take it. Uh, but but I kind of agree with you guys. There's not a lot to go on. I feel like the the first teaser had a bit more here. Uh, one thing I did notice about this because we're we're talking about the Heron Hall area. Uh, no Alice Rivers or Sarah Snow. Not a lot of uh, right, women no. in in the trailer that we haven't seen before. Any like a lot of new characters for the most part. No yeah. new characters uh, to my from what I can see here on the, on the black trailer. Um, of course, we have Rainies doing the usual. You must be careful with the dragons and power and men don't want to quit. Like usual Rainies bullshit. We always fucking get every time. It, it actually oh, yeah. really um, surprised me that there that there was none because you know you kind of go okay this is this is HBO. Uh, we need we need lots of of you know this. It's not it's not just like dragons it's tits and dragons right like we know that mm. this is like the show of tits and dragons so where are the tits and 
when 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 people when people ask me previously like oh do you think they're gonna do like Alice Rivers do you think they're gonna do Sarah Snow and I'm like do they have tits yeah they're gonna do them you know like they need to put more sex <laughs> into the show and both of those characters were rumored to be be boning some of our our, our protagonists or antagonists whichever side you're on and um, I'm just surprised I'm surprised we didn't we didn't show like a quick flash of uh, of Jace having sexy fun time or um Amond having sexy fun time or Damon having sexy fun time or any of this you know um uh i, I mean it can we briefly see Allison whoa. may have a nude scene i sent you a you both a screenshot here in the, the group chat um really? maybe foot scene? Th- there's Another also foot scene? Uh, right i i sent it to you in the group chat i oh, know i said i said they're going to do another foot scene like last last season they oh we that. didn't even that's a good point. We didn't even get uh, uh, Laris, Laris, Laris Strong. We didn't even get oh, him yeah. here. We didn't get Miz- Mizaria, the White Worm. No, we didn't. No, no Mizaria. That's a good point. A, yeah. a, a, the only ones that we were really focusing on are like the main cast of both sides. We're getting Eamon, uh Kristen Cole barely. Uh, we're getting Aegon, of course, Allison Otto Hightower. And then on the other side, of course, we're getting Rhaenyra, Jace, Damon, and barely any Corlys. Barely. No, of course. He, he appears none like of the, one none scene. None of the bastards. None of, like, none of the, the bastards. Uh, the no, no scenes. new characters. Seeds. None of them. Like that. We didn't. We, we see no, the back no. of Cregan's head, and that's it. Nothing. Nothing new. Well, you Just you kind of you kind of have to ask like, okay, what is essential for this season? Like knowing where it's going, you know that. Well, one, they've got to give time to their three leads. So obviously, of course, Rhaenyra, Alicent, and, and Damon are going to get screen time. And then, Mm -hmm. but then you're like, okay, well, we know this is leading up to Rook's rest. So we're, we, we need to have some Rainey's time. We need a lot of Rainey's time or else Rook's or else who gives a shit about Rook's rest. And we also kind of know that what's past Rook's rest, we know about the gullet. So we know that we need to give a lot more time to Jace leading up to the gullet. Um, and so, you know, I, I can kind of, I can kind of understand like why, you know, a certain number of, you know, time is getting distributed to certain people. 